Hi, I'm Sterling K. Brown, and I'm joining Justice LA and Reform LA jails by amplifying important stories. Today, I'm honored to read the testimony of Benito Venegas, a plaintiff in a lawsuit to hold the LA County Board of Supervisors and Sheriff's Department accountable to the public. I've been incarcerated at Men's Central Jail for the last two years awaiting trial. I am a 27-year-old Hispanic man with asthma and other health conditions that make me vulnerable to COVID-19. I was diagnosed with epilepsy at age 17 and had seizures about twice a month for the last 10 years. Last week I experienced two seizures on the same day. I've had seizures in the shower where I fall to the ground involuntarily and scrape myself on the shower floor. These showers are used by over 80 people daily and are not cleaned thoroughly. The guards canceled yard time in early March. Since then, we've been in our dorm all day. We all leave for our court appearances, medical visits, attorney visits, and other mandatory transports and come back to the dorm. When I see my dorm mates cough in my presence, I cover my mouth or my nose with my jail uniform. This has happened a lot in my dorm. I am afraid of retaliation by deputies if I say I need medication or treatment for potential COVID-19 symptoms. Thank you for watching and listening to the end. If this story touched you, please reach out to the Justice LA and Reform LA Jails team their hashtag suing to save lives and looking for people to step up as citizen plaintiffs in this lawsuit to show solidarity with those in our county jails. Please join them by going to bit.ly backslash suing dash to dash save dash lives. I'll tag reform LA jails in the comments so you can get involved. Stay safe and healthy.